is the end of an era. For three years, the Muni lot has served a drive through distribution spot for the Greater Cleveland Food Bank, giving boxes of food away every Thursday for those in need. Boy, well, they do a great job, don't they? they Unbelievable. Do. Today was the final day, though, but the need is still great. Brittany Weir is live with why something that has helped feed so many people for so long is now shutting down. Yeah, Tiffany and Brian, it was a bittersweet but busy day here in the Muni lot from 12 to 4. Volunteers, they were hard at work handing out food to those in need. And over 3,500 cars came through to get those meals from the Greater Cleveland Food Bank for the final time. I think we are all set. Merry Christmas to you. The Greater Cleveland Food Bank distributed food and packed up cars for one last time. <laughs> Cars lined up for miles on Thursday to get one final meal. The drive through distribution site has been serving those in need for the past three and a half years. I'm a veteran and I'm on a uh, uh, limited income and it, it really helps out. The program was started in 2020 during the pandemic. Kristen Warzaka, the president of the Greater Cleveland Food Bank, says over the years they have served more than 115,000 people and provided more than 19 million pounds of food. Certainly, this has been a distribution method um, that has that has worked in terms of providing service to people who've needed it in our community. Patty Lipinska, who was picking up meals for two other families, says she's thankful for these meals. We appreciate everything that they've done. For us throughout the year. Yvetta Nichols says these distributions have helped her cut her food bill in half. Yes, this is beautiful for Cleveland mm -hmm. to do this. This means a whole lot, especially with family and friends, and you get to cook for your family and friends with food that you really normally can't afford. The Greater Cleveland Food Bank says this was always supposed to be a temporary program. It is still bittersweet to see it end. On one hand, I'm so grateful to all of the donors and staff and volunteers who have been here alongside us, um, running these distributions, volunteering at these distributions for years now. Um, on the other hand, I'm really excited that people are going to have the opportunity to go to our new community resource center. And that center, it is located on Waterloo Road in Collinwood, and it's acting as a grocery store for anyone who needs that assistance. You can go inside and shop and pick out the food you want for your family, and we're told that that will start being operational and open to the public starting in January. Live in Cleveland, Brittany Weir, 19 News.